Hi friends, what's up? This is our Carefone 360 Reader. Right now, I'm going to show how to stop emails from loading remote images in the mail app for iPhone and iPad. Sometimes emails include formatting and images to make an email look better or more presentable like an email newsletter. But did you know that some of those remotely loaded images can also serve as trackers that let the sender know the email was opened? If you were not aware of this, you are certainly not alone. But no worries, as I will help you prevent this in the future. Many emails that you receive in your inbox may contain images or trackers in them. While most images are obvious, trackers are less so and you won't be able to see them in most cases as they are typically hidden as a tracking pixel within a link or a signature image. If an email includes trackers, when you click on the email to view the message, the track data is sent to the person or the company who added tracker to the mail. This functions as a read receipt of sorts, letting the sender know the email was opened. To prevent this from happening on your Apple device, you can change a particular setting that's available. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. To get going, launch the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. In the settings menu, scroll down and then select mail app. Here, under the messages section, you will find an option called load remote images. It's turned on by default. Use the toggle to disable it and you are good to go. That's all you have to do. There is no need to worry about the trackers in your emails anymore. But you will also find all remote images are no longer loading automatically in emails. This means that you'll have to choose the load images option if you want an email to load like it was intended from the sender that's pretty much it so that's how you can stop emails from loading remote images in the mail app on ios and ipad os device if you found this video helpful do like and share it and i'll see you in the next video with more such handy ios and ipad os hacks till then stay safe and have a great time bye bye